hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you all five styles of sneakers that you should have in your wardrobe this spring and summer if you're new to my channel welcome my name is carla and on this channel i share videos on fashion beauty and lifestyle if you enjoy these kinds of videos then please subscribe down below so like I mentioned, I'm going to be sharing with you all five styles of sneakers that you should have in your wardrobe for the summer and spring of 2022. And the first pair of sneakers that you should have are the Yeezy 450s. You've probably seen these um, on Instagram, on whatever social media platform that you spend a good majority of your time on you've most likely seen these and these are the yeezy 350s guys i cannot explain the comfort on these sneakers like oh my goodness i don't know they're like cushiony they're foamy they're i love like the knit material here that's on the sneaker it's like a, um how like a sock style of sneaker i will say that if you do plan on getting these i would recommend that you size half or actually an entire size up just for more comfort especially if you're going to be wearing like thicker socks with them i would definitely recommend that you size a full size up guys i pair these with everything everything um i feel like they go more with like a casual vibe but you could do whatever you can wear it however i get compliments on these sneakers every single time i wear them and you know the compliments are just an added bonus for me it's the comfort it's the comfort that you get with these sneakers they're just so, so comfortable if you're looking for these you're gonna definitely have to check StockX or goat um, which are that's more of like the reseller market you're definitely gonna pay more than what the release suggested price was because these are you know they sold out and that's just what the sneaker market is like if there's a hot shoe out there chances are you will not get it for the price that they were when they came out these come in this color which i prefer they also come in black which i would love to get um one because i know they're already comfortable and two because they're black sneakers they come in like a sagey color i believe those are the three colors i've seen they probably have other colors out there but those are the three that i've seen so yes a pair of Yeezy 450s should definitely be in your wardrobe this spring and summer of 2022. All right, this style, um, and I'm saying style of shoe. Let's see if it'll show you. This style of shoe is from Gucci, but you can get this style of shoe from many other brands. Like it definitely does not have to be a Gucci pair of shoes. Let me take these out um and they are the ace the gucci ace sneakers so these are pretty old um i've had these for about three or four years now but i know that usually when spring or summer comes i wear these non-stop like non-stop they're probably like all dirty on the bottom um but yeah these are a in my opinion i think these are like tennis style shoes they're like tennis shoes um you can find these in the adidas brand you can find these in the puma brand um i just so happen to have obviously the gucci pair um again and i'll reiterate you do not have to buy the gucci a sneakers you can get this style of shoe because that's what the focus is is the style of shoe and it's the tennis shoe style so yeah i really really like my gucci a sneakers i find that these pair very cute with like a cute tennis skirt and maybe like a halter top or like a flowy kind of dress in the summer um i just love these love these like you will get so much use out of these if you decide to get the gucci a sneakers i would say get your size if 
you can or if you want to half size up i would just be careful because these are leather sneakers so they will stretch over time but guys these have definitely held up um if you can see right there they've held up pretty well they have not creased much i believe Val valentino also makes a nice pair of tennis shoes as well so expect to see these a lot so the next pair of shoes are in this box they're like a beat up this box is beat up these shoes are beat up i've shared these before i've actually shared the gucci a, a sneakers before in another video um but a nike a pair of nike air force ones um growing up we call these uptowns um so for the people out there who call them uptowns a pair of white uptowns or for the people who call them air forces a pair of white nike air force ones i wear these again another pair of shoes that i wear a lot for me the major difference because you know one would ask okay carla you have so many white sneakers um why would you like why why do you have so many white sneakers for me i feel like even though i have this many white sneakers and i'm i'm showing you guys multiple pairs of white sneakers the look and the aesthetic that you'll get are completely different like these air forces um let me come up closer so you can kind of see with the air forces you see how thick this heel is so you get a thicker heel um with the air forces so these are definitely more casual right like you can wear a dress with these shoes like a flowy dress like i mentioned with the a sneakers and you're not going to get the same look that you would with a pair of gucci or like tennis shoes like do you see how the heel on these are much smaller let me show you if that's helpful at all do you see that they're much smaller so you're gonna get a different vibe and a different aesthetic with each shoe um and that's even if you take away like this entire gucci logo it has nothing to do with the logo it has to do with what you're getting with the shoe um so yeah i just wanted to point that out in case you guys are wondering why like why do you have so many white shoes they're every single one of them these as well you're gonna get a different look like these i would pair them more with like i don't know a pair of sweat bottoms or like bermuda shorts or like that kind of stuff that's the vibe that you would get um so yes a pair of white nike air forces um should be in your wardrobe so the fourth pair guys i am obsessed with these sneakers i've said this before i don't share sneakers often on my channel but trust and believe that i am a sneaker addict like i've always loved sneakers i've been into sneakers since middle school um like i've just that's just how i've been but a style of shoe i have so i have these shoes in so many colors i probably could show you how close are they I'll, I'll show you two different pairs um but they are the jordan ones um guys these sneakers i cannot tell you guys enough about a pair of jordan ones um they're not the easiest to purchase i will be honest they're not um and i think it's because many people purchase jordan ones um and i know why because they're just stunning like if you look at them they just you know that you're gonna get a good pair of sneakers that you can style so many ways i've seen people pair these or style these with like business suits like a pair of nice slacks and like a blazer which you know it doesn't look bad in my opinion i don't think it looks bad it's not how i usually style it i'm sure i could pull it off if i really wanted to but 
I don't know that's not really what I like how I style it like I said um, I would usually just pair these with a pair of jeans t-shirt maybe a blazer maybe not um, and then just go about my business this is definitely more of a casual vibe but I definitely think that if you can get your hands on a pair of Jordan ones you should get your hands on a pair so I have this coat I have so many colors but the other one that I actually ended up bringing over um, are these and I love these these believe it or not you see the red and the black in you know they may scare it may scare you a little bit but they're so easy to pair like literally so easy to pair the patent leather right here makes it so easy to pair the red can just be a pop of color so you could do something simple like a white shirt black jeans with this you can do like you know those i have those like vinyl leggings with like a sweater but we're talking sw um spring and summer so like again the biggest thing will be maybe a crop top maybe a tank top simple 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 and just have these sneakers be your focal piece but if you can get your ha your hands on a pair of Jordan 1 guys, please, please, please do. You will not be disappointed. Um, certain people usually like tie the shoelaces. I don't. Like, I usually just wear them just like that because that's the vibe I like when I wear my um, Jordan 1s. I don't know and just so you know they come in lows they come in mids and they come in highs so Jordan one low mid and high um, these are the mids I think they both are I think they both are or are these the no I lied these are the highs I'm like these look like the highs <laughs> they're the highs and these are the mids i know a lot a lot to take in sneakers are not <laughs> that simple like if you're into sneakers you know there's a lot to a pair of sneakers if you're not and you just want to pick these up you will not notice the difference but there's actually a difference and i'll i'll kind of show you really quick how i could tell that i was off when i said these are the mids if you can see do you see how for the highs this piece right here is higher they're just a higher shoe and then for the mids they're lower that's that's what that means so yes get you a pair of jordan ones and lastly guys these are i love oh my god i love these shoes like I love these sneakers um these are the collab um it's an off-white in Nike collab but a specific type of shoe from Nike and they are the Nike Dunks um these guys are huh, I just love these sneakers I love these sneakers again if you're able to get your hands on these that would be great if you can these they're not a pair of shoe that you can just go and purchase somewhere like you just can't these came out um last year and like i got notified and that's how you purchased it but if you can just get a pair of dunks they're almost like the jordan ones like almost but they're a little similar do you see that do you see how like they're a little similar but trust me they're two different shoes like you can see the front they're two different like I could tell the difference between a Nike dunk like a pair of dunks and a pair of ones like you could tell the difference um but these are just so comfortable dunks give just a different vibe they're a little wider at the toe box so if your foot is a little wider the dunks may work better for you um if they're a little narrow na if your feet are a little more narrow then the ones may be best for you but 
if you could get your hands on both then go ahead and get your hands on both the dunks come in like an array of colors you can get the orange and white the blue and white the green and white like the red and white so many colors are they cheap no can you find them yes again you're gonna be checking the stock X and the goat but they're a pair of shoes that I think everyone should have for the spring and summer of 2022 I will say that out of everything that I mentioned the easiest pair of sneakers that you'll be able to get are the uptowns or the Nike Air Force ones these may be a little easier for you to get and then maybe like a pair of tennis shoes and maybe like the 450s but for ease and for availability i would say start with the air force ones as well as just a pair of tennis shoes again you can check adidas and you can check puma um for that kind of style but yeah those are the pairs of shoes that i wanted to share with you all i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you found it helpful if you have any questions feel free to ask me down below in the comment section remember to be kind to yourself and be kind to others love yourself and love others as well also remember to follow me on instagram and tiktok at carla that's i'm in 19. see you in the next video